This is some of the most intense police body cam footage I've ever seen in my life. So just a warning as we get into this, this was all at a house party in Toledo, Ohio, where chaos broke out after a huge fight with more than 300 people erupted. 12 people were shot and one person was killed in this attack. So brace yourself as we follow this police officer going through this scene that is just absolutely incredible. Now here he is pulling up on the scene of this house party. All right, so you hear 300 people involved in this, a black man with a mask targeting people. That's what the officer hears. He very quickly gets on the scene here. And uh, as he pulls up, you can already tell like right up here. there's chaos breaking out. This is calm before the storm type stuff right here. One person fatally shot 12 people in total shot. 17-year-old Stephen uh, or Stefan Johnson is the one who uh, later died at a hospital. Watch this. Wow. Get out. Wow. Go, go, find cover. Get it. Move, move. Multiple shooters everywhere. The street west of Detroit. Imagine stay running down, into down. this. Everybody stay down. Wow. Stay down! Stay down! Hiding in between the cars. Stay down! Stay down! Stay behind the tire! Stay behind cover! Stay down! Everybody stay down! Find cover! Find a car! Jesus, man. And that's where it cuts off. Just absolute insanity. And to imagine this officer pulling up, not knowing what he was getting into, and running in to a firefight that sounded like it was coming from all directions, as opposed to running away from it, which would be your gut instinct. Anybody who wasn't one of these folks who showed up uh, in an incredibly heroic way. And it's mind-blowing that with 300 people in a massive brawl at this party that spun out of control, with 12 people who were shot by these maybe multiple shooters, only one person died. Now on to potentially the most frustrating thing that I'm going to tell you today. Here is what we're learning. Uh, according to Toledo Police, hundreds of people were fighting near Lawrence Avenue and North Detroit Avenue during a block party it was about 12.30 a.m. on Monday. They just released this body cam footage. About 80 rounds were fired from multiple guns. 17-year-old Stefan Johnson was taken to the University of Michigan by uh, Life Flight uh, for treatment where he later died, according to TPD. Two additional people were in critical condition, a 51-year-old man and a 19-year-old. They're both expected to recover. Nine people in stable condition, most of whom are teenagers, as well as an 11-year-old old child 
But that's not what you're going to get frustrated by. The victim uh, identified as the 17-year-old, there are no arrests and police said witnesses are not cooperating, says Channel 19. Also over here, TPD has not identified any suspects at this time and has said witnesses are not cooperating. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms is offering a $5,000 reward. You have 12 people shot. You have one person that was dead. You have this chaotic scene that this officer ran into, and not a single goddamn person is willing to speak about what happened. That, my friends, is a major, major problem. Because this, this will keep happening over and over and over. Go, go, find cover, do it. Move, move. All these people, there's people absolutely everywhere, and no one just, strangely enough, seemed to see anything. What do you think about the officers involved in this video? How do you think they did performance-wise? Because I was incredibly impressed with their bravery myself. Also, uh, what what should you do? What do you do about a situation where the folks, uh, hundreds of them, who are involved in this incident, who are at this incident, refuse to speak with police? So you have mass shootings and nobody wants to talk about it, whether for fear of retribution or for fear of being labeled a snitch in the neighborhood. You know, these are major problems. How do you handle this? What do you do about that? And just overall, your thoughts about the video in the comments below. You got to share this with a friend. You know somebody who needs to see this. Hit that share button and spread the word. If you're new here over at Facebook.com slash the news junkie, all you have to do is hit follow and you'll get videos just like this every single day also uh, you can subscribe over at youtube.com slash the news junkie i appreciate you watching as always and we'll talk to you again real soon